How's it going everyone and welcome back to the lava cave series in this one we continue to build up our cave eliminate our competition and move towards day two of the server as you can probably hear your boy got his voice back for a little while but i'm gonna have some more teeth out so it might not be back for too long if we could hit 1.5k likes that'd be really sick and with that all out of the way let's head over to the extinction desert and tame up some more velos Bro, rifle is uglier than me. RIP! That bozo just got clapping! <laughs> clapping, he's... <laughs> By any chance, Zavi, is that gonna go in the video? Yes, of course it is! <laughs> With Dylan <laughs> saying rifle's uglier than me in the background. <laughs> 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 you saw that Z-spin though, that was clean, fam! Too cold on my life! He had no parachutes, he was dead anyway! In the velos. What? I'm still mad about the stove. What do you mean? I'm mad about the stove. Yeah. Oh, we got a fucking beast ass female 43. Wait, wait, melee mutation on the, the uh, velos. 40? Oh my god, beautiful. 40. Nice. 43 HP, 40 melee on a female as well. It's guaranteed. A good stat melee or. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, it's a mutation on the good stat melee. Yeah, something else in there. Yeah. Nice. Beautiful. Now those velos are insane. For like two hours into wipe, that's like the best stats on the server, 100%. Velos are so hard to get good stats on. They always spawn so low level for me. Yeah. So like, getting that at all is kind of insane to me. I'm gonna get some beds down in easy underwater real quick. We can just go back, we're gonna mine it. Oh yeah, we could definitely just uh, fast travel to that constantly. Do you reckon I can get down there with scuba? Yeah. Uncomforting, yeah. I got no oxygen pumped, but I wish I'll see. I'm gonna try and get down to easy underwater if I can. I then big dubs. Let's check the pearl cave by easy underwater. Let's see if anyone's built in there. People like this pearl cave, so. When you want? Oh, you're the one next easy. Oh! 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 Fucking hell! <laughs> <laughs> oh! Oh Grab my them. god! Alpha Tuto nearly slapped Savage. Oh, that's a Megalodon, brother. Not Tuto. That's a Megalodon. No, oh, yeah, you there's... don't understand, my guy. Oh. You see his little nose popping up. Oh, that is my adrenaline for the night, mate. Oh. Do you reckon I should just pop the beds down in here? I don't know. I... Will I be able to outswim that thing? Probably not. Ah, uh, fuck no. Beds are going to get blown, though, but you could do it. Oh. So we also have the same idea. I wish just have like uh, two, six hundred uh, Dura flak legs, BP. Okay. Nah, uh, you're good. Oh! What do you have? Well, now you can get in the cave. What did it have? Two cryodicthes. Heck. The thing is, if he's got stuff in here, does that mean there's going to be turrets in the cave? Like, why would he not put stuff in the cave? Maybe he, he can't build in there. To be fair. I can't. Wait, I'm very confused. I'm gonna need to get this Ickley out and saddle it before the South Megal gun fucks me. Just swim out and up, maybe. Maybe it'll like, get stuck inside the cave if you, if you do it fast. You know what I mean? Fast is Savvy's middle name and the one pump wonder. Uh, I wouldn't mind that then. Did he get stuck in the cave? I did. Gotta throw it back down there with him, but. I'm fucking drowned, I'm dying of cold. I, I don't think I die in cold of cold and easy underwater, though. Don't die, my friend. No, you don't. Level movement speed. Yes, yeah, Savvy, God. Trying to help me, trying to talk. Pinky is the backseat, backseat gamer. He helps me out very much. You can't say anything, mate. You cannot say anything. I know I can't. Yeah, why does this guy not just put shit? Oh, there is things in these underwater. Don't know why that guy didn't just build a box around his fucking bed. No red drop. There. Can't place this underwater. You're having a wank. No! Oh fuck, that thing can die. That's <laughs> an L for the Eckley boy. Oh, I ripped the Manta. Haha, <laughs> Manta, Manta got baited. Manta baited. Manta baited. <laughs> Manta core? <laughs> that sounds like a, uh, a scene, bro. That thing is tanking. What do you mean by that? <laughs> well, just us trying, bro. 
I think we are the specialist and sausage tribe going. Don't class me any of you guys, that's you guys. Fuck you guys. So with that bed established, we could fast travel to it from base and keep running easy underwater for some decent blueprints. And with the drops respawning, we'd be able to run it every 30 minutes or so. But yeah, after that, I headed out on a PT to try and find a doe as they spawn on the metal mountains. However, on the way there, I found a little base and this is what happened. I have rockets. It's got a long neck. Whereabouts? Whereabouts? Oh, I'm probably fucking dead. Uh... Ah, uh, it's two. This is a bad idea. Where are you? Um, look at my screen. Uh, you're by Twin Pillars, aren't you? He's tracking up my fucking PT. I'm coming. I think that's Twin Pillars. I hope that's Twin Pillars. I can't do subscribe. Give me a long neck. Yay, I don't actually know where you are. Look, look at my stream. By North 1, kind of. Let's dip out, let's this wicked. By North 1. I'm trying to get a fucking... Coming. Oh, this guy wants me fucking dead. Oh, I know you are. I need these XP notes to fight them. I'm on my way, I'm at the yellow drop. Yeah, I need these XP notes to fight them, this is a fresh PT. Yeah, yeah. Alright, I'm coming. I'm here. You're going up the mountain. Is he still on you? No, no. I'm just getting these XP notes and I'm coming back. You have C4, yeah? Or rockets? I've got uh, rockets. Give me two seconds. Wait, there's a there's a base on top of the uh, hill. Really? Heavies. Yeah, or is it two ores? I can't get close enough. You could go to the backside, Savvy, in K-Mode. I still have the cried Velo on me, by the way. It's one one heavy and two ores. Boys. Is it is there is the heavy on one side? Yeah. No, it's on both sides. No, it's not. Look. I'm He's joking. being sarcastic. He can't be on both sides. Oh. Is that more worth reading in the extinction thing though? No, the extinction thing is definitely more worth it. I think. It's these that don't have um, indie forge yet, but they do have heavies. So yeah, with that, I'd accidentally stumbled across a new raid target, and we also had the extinction base that we were referring to in the clip that Pinky actually found, and we were going to raid it after we raided the one in the redwoods that I'd just seen. So after I'd leveled up my PT, I headed back and helped out the boys raid the other base. Did I hear a compound bomb? Yeah, me. Antico. Where'd the other one go? Throwing Vila. Somebody loot, somebody loot. Going inside the loot. Yeah, I'm protecting you if you loot. Is that one of the main wings? One of them's running. Honestly, them's you running. might as well put that on turret mode. Bro. Guy's running, he's back. parachuting. Somebody fabby him or shoot him with a thingy. Oh, he's gone. GG. Where at? Which way? That way, he's literally just straight. You see him parachute. He's down here, I think. Parachute, he's going into the forest. You see the parachute to your right. Yeah. There might be someone transferring. I don't mind. Dead body. I don't see shit in there. Yeah, I can't find it, there's no way. Oh, what the fuck? Drug on BP in the yellow drop. Had to take out their graphing station. They didn't even have the a copy in. fucking hurts. I bouldered one of them as well, that's the annoying thing, but they don't last long enough, so they ended up getting out. Mm -hmm. well, there wasn't much in here, by the way. Yeah, I didn't expect that to be. 600 cooked meat, let's go. Not even metal on the forges. Just... That, that, that. Yeah, none, nothing. Oh, wait, actually, I'll take that hide. Yep. Yeah, I think they LB'd most of it, to be honest. Let's go Extinction Raid quick before they get heavies. I'm going to the yellow drop over here. So yeah, apart from some resources, that base really didn't have that much. But it was a cheeky raid with a bit of PvP, so it was still a bit of fun. But yeah, after that, we headed over to Extinction, where Pinky had found a decent base to raid in the snow, being all stone and a few autos. However, we soon saw something that would be a big turnoff for the raid. And where was the base? Where are you? It's like right beneath you, pretty much. Oh, it's in this building, okay. Oh, did they make heavies? Oh, shit on them. Go on. Yeah, they did. Did they actually? Uh, yes. How many? A lot. Really? Yeah. I'll take shield off. Shield off. More that. Wait. Uh, Five or oh, six. Wait. Is it close enough, though, to see no. spin and just get one rocket off? I guess they're online as well. What about if we were to strap a C4 to the May Wing, go from the left hand side and in? No way. Uh, I don't think it's worth it. There's a lot of fucking thing there. A, lot of a long time to come over here. 
where I wanted to go. Oh, that's so sad, man. Oh, we should... Uh, yeah, next raid we find that's a good target, we should just focus it. Yep. That sucks as well. That was such a good, good, easy raid. So yeah, that's a plain example in Ark of how minutes can matter, especially on wipe day. Because if we were about 30 minutes earlier, they wouldn't have had heavies and it would be the easiest raid of our life. And with the amount of resources they had waiting to craft those heavies, we could have got so much out of it. So yeah, just kind of unfortunate in the end. However, after seeing that base in the snow, I decided to head over to Valgaro, where there's a lot of snow plateaus and even an ice cave. So I went to scout it to see what was cooking there. And then while I was in the snow, I decided to go and see if I could get some Live and eggs. Holy. What? Chocky bar. No way somebody actually built that cave. Oh my. No, it's a, it's a good cave. It's not. No, it's shit. Oh, you should have seen me looking at it before one. It? It's, it's a joke's cave. Pretty sure it got changed, no? Small. Yeah, it, it, it is, but it's. It's it just spam it like ruins. You're gonna get fucked up by uh, ice weapons. Ice weapons, bro. It's if they hit me. Actually, so I won't be against BTs. Oh, hi. Or 80 down a leg, sir? I mean... Is it worth taking the level 55 ice egg? No way this guy is farming ice wyvern eggs. Ice wyverns are underrated and I will die on that hill. I honestly just like ice wyverns. They're such good support, wyverns. Cycle. I got no stamina off that. What the fuck? Oh shit. <laughs> yeah, get yeah. Pen. I didn't bowl Savi. Please don't die. Or maybe Savi will let you. I need to fly straight up on Savi. Oh yeah, Savi bowled me. Weapons. <laughs> How the fuck am I alive, man? That's a very good question, I could not tell you. What? You shouldn't be alive. Huh? He got picked by a PT after we got the Wyvern Egg and he just got dropped into a fucking Amantis. While Lord. being vested on by Wyverns. Should I go tame a Megatherium? You should, go you should go tame Mantis. Yeah, but uh, um, we should... Mm. <laughs> I'll show you Dama first. Triplet Wyverns, bang. Fuck. That could actually be a lot worse. What? His well, worst stats are oxygen and food on the Wyvern. What? Wyvern and what stats? Level 95 fire. So after I popped that Wyvern, Pinky dropped me this from a BP that he'd got from the Rack Desert. That was heavy. Look at this. It's on the floor. <gasps> OP. So after I saw that club BP, I had some flashbacks to what you're seeing on your screen now, and what would a Zavi series be without going to Ragnarok to tame a few Mantis? The issue was I didn't have bug repellent this time, so I put together a set of gilly, and grabbed some cactus broth, and went to see if that would do the trick. However, I needed some rhino horns first, so obviously I went to grab some. <laughs> Stego BP! No way. How good? 50 armor journeyman. No, 50 armor apprentice. Ooh, that'll still get like 60. It's usable. It's usable. That's, that's huge here. Yeah. That's huge. From a fucking normal draw. Oh, he won that me, bro. His shotgun's good. His shotgun and Vila. Yeah, we might. This might be more of a problem than we thought. If you want to go back, Dylan. He won that me through my legs. Where, where is he? At our base? base? At base, we're getting raided. I wouldn't necessarily be getting raided, but... Well, oh, there's three of them. The shotgun in the VLO's three crouch. Back him up. Oh, I can't. I'm dead. I'm on at least one time. He won't tap me through my flank. Should I, should I come back? Yeah, probably. 150 Mantis. It. 
Right, well, I found a pack of three Mantis, and it was a 1 for 5, 150, and 100, and I can breed them up as well, so that's a fat dub. What the fuck? Well, I got three Mantis eggs and five Mantis. So yeah, that was pretty much our cave defense sorted for the first few days, as Mantis are really overpowered in small entrances, and there really isn't that much counterplay to them, especially in a cave like ours. And we would prove it over the coming days when Alpha Tribes came to fob us. However, I still had to get out of the server with all the Mantis on me, and it was a lot closer than I would have hoped. It's, uh, I've got my moving. Just, you just need to grab the Yankee saddle. Someone was literally running over to pump me, bro. Someone was literally running over. I mean, I see why. I joined fucking MTS instead of fucking INX, man. There's two Manda's eggs for anyone if they want it. Well, I'm down to pop one if uh, no one else if I want it. Yeah, I don't really care. I was only really gonna pop one if we could use them for um, Golem. Not, you can't not use teams in there, and, so Yeah, I'm not really careful. I mean, maybe one or two would be nice for like base defense, but. Yeah. After hatching the mantises and getting our cave defense sorted, my focus was now to get some rhinos so we could get the boss fights going. So I headed back to the snow on Ragnarok, and instead of driving rhinos to extinction, I started poisoning them instead. 32 HP free time. That, that can come out like 54 plus. But we can combine it later, let's just get the. That's what I'm saying. Up. 54 HP rhinos, nobody's killing that. Ooh, 27 melee rhino. Ooh. Uh, oh, this fucking 28 melee rhino came out 36, bro. Nah, bro, what? We got 43 HP, though. So I bred up the rhinos and waited for them to gestate, and while I was doing that, I went to try and knock out a doed, and yeah, it was pretty interesting to say the least. No! No, boys! Well, it's not table goal anymore. <laughs> we'll see about that, boss. It will go into a ball before he took and knocks out, but... Yeah, nice ball, kid. This guy in the mirroring rocks up, and I'm gonna riot. He just mirroring yoinks my teams. Whistle attack, that. Oh, that would be fucking dope. No, it wouldn't. That would be fucking sick. That would make him so hard. I could... It'd be hilarious for us. Oh! Oh, it's a female, but it's a really good rhino. Shit. Well, now we have... What is it? The melee and the HP combined. I'm calling it triplet males, but shit. I'm saying... You know, twin males, but shit. I'm saying twin male with melee, but no HP. Thing is literally Single. one shot. Literally the opposite of everything. <laughs> Single... <clears throat> uh... Melee, I guess. Are we doing beta valg or beta rank or alpha? Just alpha valg? I mean, it's easy unless you want to do. Uh... You sure we can do it? We did it, me, you, and KO, I remember. Yeah, but that was not tamed rhinos. That was imprint rhinos with good saddles and cakes. Yeah, they were imprint, but we just go to Gen 1 and just do the AE armor rhino saddle thing mission. I mean, if we're doing center anyway, we should be fine for it at least. Yeah, but we want transmitter Ingram. Otherwise, we gotta wait until tomorrow to get transmitter. Yeah, transmitter as is Jenny. And so yeah, now we had cave defense dinos, dinos for boss fights and meat running, and also turret dinos in Velonosaurs that we could use to defend our cave and do lava golem with for blueprints. So honestly, a pretty successful episode in terms of taming. Sorry there wasn't much PvP, but the future episodes are going to have some really nice PvP and raids, so look forward to that. Please feel free to leave a like on the episode guys, it would really help me out. Let's see if we can get to 1.5k likes, and if you made it this far, leave the word mantis in your comment and I'll be sure to heart it, as I always like taming mantis on Ragnarok. So it's no surprise that it happened this episode but yeah i'll leave you guys with some funny clips and i'll see you in the next one take care hey man i just spawned i don't have anything i really have nothing i actually just spawned. i'll let you be my friend don't i literally worry. have a i gotta start a kit man <laughs> like that's it I promise icebox bear icebox i if, you, if you're actually icebox then i don't i don't recognize icebox's voice because the last time i played with him Wait was a like minute. fucking ages ago so yeah you know who you sound like hold on go back here huh Wait a minute. Wait! Back! I watched your YouTube video this morning. Aw, thank you, my friend. <laughs> hey, fan.
Hey, uh, I saw that uh, that video on your server with the speed hacking guy, dude. That shit looks. Bro, so man was like Sonic the Hedgehog moving through the desert. <laughs> dude, that shit was crazy. <laughs> yeah, fam. Why are you in here? You come for the fresh white? Yeah, I did. Uh, me and Shantico are playing. We're in that cave just over there. Oh yeah, your parasaur was picking me up a minute ago. I was about to say, oh, we should go raid. <laughs> I'll, I'll see you there, bro, in a bit. All right, boy. You better be there. When we come back, son. You know, you know. Can you hear my mouse? I'm used to it. I've got eight uh, yeah. <laughs> I heard the skull wheel. Logitech G502. What did you say, Sam? Logitech G502. Yeah. What? You can already tell. You just <laughs> named the mouse he was using oh. by the skull wheel when he sculled it. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Really easy. <laughs> when, when, you, when you've owned that mouse, it's easy to understand which one. Yeah, listen. listen. I have the wireless one. I, I Well, I have a wireless and a wired. The wired one broke. <laughs> really? Yeah. After sort of fucking like five, six years. I've had mine probably about five, six years now, to be fair. 